Just over a month after taking office, Premier Charles de Gaulle revisits Algeria and finds his popularity has waned. French ultras resent his policy of moderation. The Muslim masses seem unconvinced by promises of equality. De Gaulle seeks to gain support among the Muslims and among the younger army officers outside the city of Algiers, where the leaders of the May uprising are still powerful. If the general secures broad support, he may move farther toward solving France's gravest problem. In Paris, after de Gaulle's return, Secretary of State Dulles arrives, bearing an invitation from President Eisenhower for a Washington visit when de Gaulle gets the problems of his nation under control. The talks between Dulles and de Gaulle brought general agreement on the world situation, but left one area of disagreement. De Gaulle wants France to develop her own atomic weapons, in keeping with her standing as a great nation. Dulles's reservation, another atomic power, and a new series of nuclear tests might jeopardize all hopes for disarmament. And under existing law, Dulles can offer de Gaulle no atomic know-how.